Hey guys, we're back with another unboxing. So I've got the Hosum X05. It's four wheel drive, has metal shocks, 2.4 gigahertz radio, 1500 milliamp battery, comes with a brushed motor. It is a Hosum 110 scale, which means in reality it is like a 112th scale RC, but it is probably the entry level in their lineup, right? This is aimed for beginners. Uh, which is pretty cool because I don't have any of their entry-level trucks. So it's the Truggy style body. They also have another version with a truck body, but I think this looks super cool. Of course, you get your charger, right? And that's pretty standard USB charger. Then you get some parts, some screwdrivers, the wrench, everything you need there, extra body clips. You get a card for a one year warranty, always register your host me. So you get some extra parts, things like that. <clears throat> they give you a bag with some more body clips in there, although it does have tethered body clips and a little brush to clean off the car. I do wanna add here that Hosum reached out to me and sent me this on my TikTok. They said, hey, we like your content. We wanna send you something to promote. Now that doesn't mean I'm going to give this an easy review, but uh, just wanted to throw it out there. So you could tell it has friction shocks. It's pretty bouncy. <laughs> um, that drop test does not look good to me, but again, this is entry level in their lineup. It's uh, $100 regular price. I've seen it discounted at 80 bucks for a while. It is ready to run, so it comes with a remote, you know, everything you're going to need except for AA batteries, um, but most people tend to have those in stock, uh, unless it's a gift, maybe you want to get some for whoever you're gifting it to. Another thing to point out is it does have skid plates on the top of the body there to help when it flips over, try to keep the body a little safer, hopefully it doesn't break right away, you know, it is a nice feature. So again, we've got two 1500 milliamp batteries. Uh, it does say LiPo, but I'm pretty positive they're lithium ion just based off of experience in the budget RC world. Um, very bouncy friction shocks. <laughs> they look nice, but you know, there's, there's nothing there, right? Uh, the CVDs on this are all plastic. It has metal turnbuckles they are adjustable three kilogram servo it's five wires so if you want to upgrade that you do need to upgrade the esc but again entry level this is nothing uh too fancy right it, it is on the same chassis as the hosum x07 that's kind of like their flagship the x07 x08 they've, they've been around for a while brushless version metal parts all that fun stuff this is a entry point. Um, and I think it's a good way to go about it because, you know, I've seen reviews where people say, hey, awesome RC, super fast. My kids broke it after the first battery pack because they couldn't control it, right? This is a way to address that. You have something for kids or first time RC users trying to get into the hobby. This is perfect in my opinion, but I haven't driven it yet, right? So you should fully charge the batteries before you turn it on, but I just wanted to do a quick little test. The servo is actually pretty quick at turning. It sounds like it's a pretty, I don't know, it's gonna be pretty slow, let's be real. It's a 390 motor in a larger body for an RC, right? But uh, it, seemed, it might do okay, it, it could surprise me, we will see. But I'm excited about it, and like I said, I got this for free. One of my good friend's daughter has been wanting to get into the RC world, and I figured this is the perfect fit for her, right? I mean, it's something basic to start out with. If she breaks anything, the owner manual has the exploded diagram. It has all the parts. So my friend, her dad, could go ahead, order those parts for whatever broke, and fix it. Or you could always upgrade it because it seems shares the same chassis as the X07. You can make it brushless or just get a bigger motor, oil filled shocks, metal dog bones and CVDs, all that fun stuff. So I think it's a good starter truck. 
and I can't wait to test it out. But uh, it definitely looks great and I'm excited about it. I hope you're all having a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.